Can you believe we're at season six already? I know, wild, right? No, it's I amazing. really can't actually. It's wild. Oh, it's gone fast. Yeah. Are you guys back to shooting, or do you have the scripts now? Or you're shooting. We're shooting. We're like midway through. We just oh, okay. finished episode six of season six, and then we're uh, yeah, we're halfway through. What can you kind of start oh, to tease? <laughs> I don't know exactly. You know, I should really ask my husband. Well, you'll be talking to my husband. <laughs> what can I tease? You know, I can say that Gemma uh, starts out in a pretty good place, which is something we haven't necessarily seen. Um, I don't know, she's, she's just always got some major order going on. But at least at the beginning, she's pretty happy. She's got a new guy in her life. She likes that. She likes that. He's back. That's kind of what's going on. But you know, very soon the ship will fly. Yeah. <laughs> because it has to. Won't stay nice for long. <laughs> we'll talk a little bit about working with Jimmy and, and kind of the, I don't know, maybe the differences between your relationships that you've had with Ron's character and with Jimmy now and kind of why you think Gemma goes towards Nero and why she feels well, comfortable. I really do think that her and Clay crossed the same lines uh, in her opinion that are just irreparable. And I think that what she ended up doing at the end of season five, which was definitely, you know, um, something he didn't see coming, um, she had made some decisions about that already. And Nero certainly sort of helped her make those decisions. She's, it's a different kind of relationship that she has with Nero. You know, I always look at it like um, Clay is kind of this, um, what he was, sort of a cold-blooded killer, really. You know? And um, Nero is a different type. Nero also comes from a, a, an outlaw life. He's just a little more hard. The show touches on so many kind of dark themes. Do you, is it is it tough to get into that mindset, that world, or is it easy to shake when you you know at the end of the day? It's kind of easy to shake, but it definitely takes a minute to get into. You know, I'm always I'm always reminding myself as an actor that her point of view is not my point of view. You know, the choices she makes are not choices. They're not of me. So even though I feel very rooted in that character, she definitely takes a minute to, you know, it's like I don't get a script and think, well, I wouldn't say that because Gemma would say it. So, uh, and that's really kind of the fun of it, I think. When you, uh, when you get first get the script, since you played her for so long, uh, is it kind of like shorthand now? Or are you still like writing notes and like doing, you know what no, I mean? I do a lot of prep. Do you? Yeah. A lot of prep because the stories get complicated. So the relationships have all shifted so much. Like who do you like, who you're not like, who, who did what to who. You know? So there's a lot of sort of remembering what went on. But no, I do a lot of, uh, you know, I just like to have a lot of understanding of where I've been where I'm going. So sometimes I have to do that kind of work. Where is the Gamma Terra relationship going? Would you prefer them to get back together or do you expect to find a fight Well, I cannot give away too much. Um, I can tell you though that at the beginning, you know, it gets cleared up pretty soon. I don't think it's just giving away too much. <laughs> <laughs> Topic. Will she sing again in the next season? Will there be new songs? Singing? Yeah. Oh yeah, I'll sing. I sing one song every every season, and then I have a new record coming out too. Hope you guys are all right about. <laughs> when is it coming out? Um, I'm gonna. It's gonna come out probably end of September, middle of October. Um, and I I made it with Bob Thiel, who does all our music on the show. And I know you went on tour for a little bit, right? Yeah, we did a little bit of touring. Yeah. SOA, Forest Rangers, Katy tour, and. Uh, Super fun. So I know I'm singing one song on the rep on the season that will also be on my record. And then I'm gonna I think I'm singing something else. But I can't tell you I cannot tell you anything. Can you tell us what are your favorite TV shows right at the moment? Oh, that's a good question. Let's see. I just started watching uh, uh, Orange is the New Black and I do like it. I love 
Sarah Familia on Batesville Talk. I have not watched the entire thing, but what I've seen is she's just unbelievable. I think she's great. I love Boardwalk Empire. I'm looking forward to that coming back. I, um, there's so much television to watch. I've watched Scandal. I do like Scandal. Is there a show where you're embarrassed to tell us that you watch? Scandal. <laughs> <laughs> oh, this is like my guitar. But I think it's awesome. You know, I, it probably doesn't kind of go with my tough girl bike image. But, um, you know, no, I, I really I think Scandal's great because I, I love the political of it. I think the actors are really good. Um, when you have time off, do you try to audition for these shows or contact them? No, I, I really haven't had the time off yet. In my last hiatus, I made a movie, which was really fun. And I've been working on my record. You know, pretty soon I'll need a job. So, you know, I can make the rounds. There's uh, lots of crazy stuff that goes down on the show, and from the very beginning you knew this was going to happen, maybe you even more so early on than anybody else. Is there anything over the course of the series that when it happened, or you saw the script, that you were like, really? You th you're having me do that? That even you thought was really Yeah, there's been really several of those. But see, I wear a different hat with it. You know, as an actor, I'm glad to be given the things that, as Katie, would be like, are you kidding me? I am not doing that. But as an actor, you know, it makes it interesting. You, know, you want to be sort of given, you know, that's, that's part of it. That's part of the journey of being an actor, is that you're exploring the human condition. So in whatever form is what's going on. So that's kind of fun, actually, when it comes up to that. There's a few things this season where I'm like, really? Okay. <laughs> You're kind of coming up on the end now, season six. You, well, at least in, you know, Kurt's yeah. plan for the show. Does it feel like things are starting to work towards wrapping up? Yeah. Yeah? It does a little bit in terms of, well, I don't really know that the answer. Only because I'm not so close to the creator. <laughs> but I kind of know the pieces that he's thinking of. But, um, yeah, so I don't know if you're going to watch it and go, oh, yeah, we're almost to the end. I, I don't know. We have to wrap up.